in this video, we are collecting 131 geocally. If you follow closely and carefully, it should take you roughly an hour and a half. Before we get started, I would recommend you to have unlocked all the statue, waypoints and domains in Li Yue. I have another video for that if you need. Then you need one animal character and one geo character that can place geo construct such as your traveler. You can switch the element by interacting with a geo statue. And the ESQ can place a geo construct that we can climb up. And to switch back to animal, simply interact with an animal statue. If you don't have an extra animal or geo character, then you will have to switch your traveler's element back and forth, which may be annoying from time to time. But other than that, good to have a high character such as Kaya so that we run faster, and Amber so that we can glide longer. Alright, then without further ado, let's get started. First, let's teleport to this waypoint. Turn around and look up. In the east direction, right side on the map, there's one in the tower. Then let's teleport to this domain. Head west, left side on the map. And climb up here. There's one floating near the tree. Then keep heading west, left side on the map, and climb up on the mountain. We are going to climb all the way up there. It's going to be a long climb, so take your time. The next one is floating in the air in the west direction, left side on the map. Then head southwest, down left on the map. Look down, it's floating in the air above the chest. Then head south, downward on the map. Jump down here. This one is floating here. Then head southwest, down left on the map. Take a right turn, it's in this corner. Then head southwest, down left on the map. 
it's behind this rock. Then teleport to this waypoint. Jump down here in the southeast direction, down right on the map. It's floating here. Keep heading south, downward on the map. This one is floating in the air. You can climb up on this tree and jump over to collect it. Or place a geo construct to climb up. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head east, right side on the map. Jump down here, it's underneath the bridge. Then teleport back, head northeast up right on the map. It's floating here. Then head northeast up right on the map. Follow this path. Let's climb up here. It's floating on the rock. Then teleport to this waypoint. This one is on top of this building in the southwest direction, down left on the map. So let's first get on this building in the south direction, downward on the map. Climb up here and let's place a geo construct on the roof. Climb up and glide west, left side on the map. Then teleport back and head north, upward on the map. This one is underneath the house. Then teleport back again. Head northeast up right on the map. Glide towards the middle. Place a geo construct and collect it. Teleport back again. Head west, left side on the map. Climb onto this tree. and jump onto this building. This one is floating in the air in the northwest direction up left on the map. Keep heading northwest.
jump on this pillar here. And the next one is in the west direction, left side on the map. Then head northeast, up right on the map. Go around the house here and head east, right side on the map. Climb up here. And climb up on this tree. This one is floating in the branches. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head north upward on the map. Jump down here and turn right. In the southeast direction, down right on the map, there's a little cave. Inside, there's the next one. Then head north upward on the map. There's an entrance here. Enter it and follow the path. Climb up here behind this ruined guard. Place a jewel construct and to collect the next one. Then teleport back again. Head southwest down left on the map. This one is floating on this building. Then teleport back again. Climb up here in the southeast direction, down right on the map. This one is floating in the air. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head northwest up left on the map. This one is floating on the rock. Teleport back again. Head southeast down right on the map. Climb up here. This one is floating in front of the waterfall. Then let's climb back up. In the northeast direction, up right on the map, there's one floating on this tree. Next, let's teleport to this statue. 
in the east direction, right side on the map. There's one on this tree trunk. Teleport back to the statue. Head northwest, up left on the map. This one is floating on this rock. So we need to place a drill construct. Teleport back to the statue. Head southwest, down left on the map. Swim across. This one is floating on this hub. Next, head southwest, down left on the map. Towards this tree. Then glide northwest, up left on the map. Climb up on the hill. The next one is inside this wind barrier in the southwest direction, down left on the map. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head north upward on the map and go up one level. Take a left turn to go on to the roof. Come up here. This one is floating in the southeast direction, down right on the map. Then head west, left side on the map, and glide down slowly. Turn around, this one is floating in the southeast direction, down right on the map. Descend slowly and you will see it underneath here. Then teleport back and jump down here in the southeast direction, down right on the map. It's underneath this bridge. Next, we are going to need an animal character. Teleport back again and head northeast up right on the map. There's a pinwheel here, so use an animal character to activate it. Ride the wind current up to collect it. Next, teleport to this waypoint. Head southwest, down left on the map. Use your animal character here to activate the pinwheel. Ride the wind current up and collect it. Then teleport to this domain. Climb up in the southwest direction, down left on the map.
then climb up on this building. Turn south downward on the map. Break this barrel to break the rock pile. Defeat the enemies here, and the gate will open. Inside, to the right, there's one in this corner. Then exit here, and head southeast down right on the map. Climb up on this mountain. Then teleport to this statue. Head northeast up right on the map. Then glide northwest up left on the map towards this mountain. Climb up. Next, teleport to this waypoint. Head northeast up right on the map. It's floating on this branch. Keep heading northeast up right on the map. Look down, it's floating above the water. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head northeast up right on the map and follow this path. Come to the edge here and use an animal skill to activate the pinwheel. Ride the wind current up to collect this one. Then keep gliding east right side on the map towards this mountain. It's going to be a long climb, so take your time.
come all the way up here. Use a pyro character to activate this torch. This wind current will appear. Ride the wind current up to collect the next one. Then head northeast up right on the map. Jump down here. This one is floating on the roof. Next, we are going to need a dual character, so teleport to this statue. Head southeast down right on the map. Look down, there's one. Then head west, left side on the map. Look down, there's another one. Then glide south, downward on the map. Towards this rock. Place a dual construct here. Then head southwest down left on the map. Swim across. This one is floating on the dock, so place a dual construct here. Then teleport to this waypoint. Climb up in the northwest direction, up left on the map. Then jump down here in the northeast direction, up right on the map. This one is floating above the water. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head west, left side on the map. Jump down here and turn around, this one is underneath the bridge. Then keep heading west, left side on the map. From here, head south, downward on the map. Mm -hmm. 
and head east right side on the map. The next one is behind this rock. Then teleport back to this statue. Head north upward on the map. Jump down here, there's one floating above this house. Then teleport to this domain. Head southeast down right on the map. Climb up here. Keep heading southeast. This one is floating on this pillar. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head southeast down right on the map and climb up here. This one is floating on the tree. Next, we are going to need an animal character. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head south downward on the map. From here, head southeast down right on the map. This one is floating in the air, and we're going to need to place a geo construct. Teleport back again. Head southwest down left on the map. Enter this tunnel here and follow this path. Take a left turn, there's one. Then exit here and keep heading south downward on the map. Follow this path. Come to this pinwheel and activate it using an animal skill. Ride the wind current up and collect it. Then head north upward, upward on the map. Jump down here. It's inside this building. Then teleport to this waypoint. Turn around. There's one floating above the water in the northwest direction, up left on the map. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Head southwest down left on the map. It's floating on the rock. Then teleport to this domain. Head west left side on the map and follow this path. Take a left turn here.
climb up on this rock. There's a pinwheel. Use an animal character to activate it and a wind current will appear. Ride the wind current up and glide west left side on the map. And we're going to need a geo character. Then teleport back to the domain. And head west left side on the map. Exit the cave here and take a left turn. Follow this path to go up. We are heading to the top here. So let's climb up in the northeast direction up right on the map. Place a geo construct here. Then glide southeast down right on the map towards this boat. The next one is floating on this pole. Teleport back to the domain again. Head north upward on the map. From here, head northwest up left on the map. This one is floating up here. So let's climb up here. Then glide north upward on the map. We are going to need an animal character, so switch the element if you don't have the extra character. Come to the edge here, activate this pinwheel using an animal skill. Ride the wind current up and glide north upward on the map towards this island.
next teleport to this waypoint. Head east, right side on the map, and follow this path. Fly southeast down right on the map. Go around the shore. Climb up on the mountain here. Turn northeast up right on the map. We are going to glide towards this boat. If it is your first time here, then you will enter a cutscene and receive a world quest. Then climb up on the pole here and turn around. Get onto the roof and climb up. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Head northeast up right on the map. We are going to climb up on this mountain. It's going to be a long climb, so take your time. Then climb up on this tree. Then glide northwest up left on the map. This one is floating on this pillar. Then teleport to this waypoint. 
head southeast down right on the map. This one is floating on the branch. Next, teleport to this waypoint. Head northeast up right on the map. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head southwest down left on the map. Jump down here. Turn around in the north direction up war on the map. There's a tunnel. There's a little cave. Follow this path in and there's one. Then exit here and head south downward on the map. Jump down here in front of the statue. Near the bushes there's an opening. Jump inside, there's one. Then teleport back and head northwest up left on the map. Climb up here, there's a cave in the north direction upward on the map. And the next one is floating in the air. So climb up on the rock here. Turn around and glide towards it. Then teleport back again. Head northwest up left on the map. This time we're going to climb up on this mountain. It's going to be a long climb, so take your time. Then head north upward on the map. To the edge here, there's a dual pillar. Activate it and go through these platforms. At the end here, we need to place a dual construct. Then jump down here in the southwest direction, down left on the map. There's a stairs. 
so let's enter it and follow the path. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Head southwest down left on the map. This one is floating in the air, and we need to place a geo construct. Then head west, left side on the map. This one is floating on the hub. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head northwest up left on the map. Jump down here. This one is inside this hub. Teleport back to this waypoint. Head east, right side on the map. This one is floating in the air, and if you missed it, simply jump down here, there's a pinwheel, and you can use an animal character to activate it to create a wind current, then you can simply glide up. Next teleport to this waypoint, head northwest up left on the map. This one is floating on the tower. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head west, left side on the map. Jump down here. Then teleport back. Head southwest down left on the map. From here, head west, left side on the map. We are going to head towards this machinery. Climb up on it. This one is floating on the top. Then head north upward on the map towards this tower. Yeah. 
climb up on it. Then teleport to this statue. Head west, left side on the map. This one is floating on the gate. Then head northwest up left on the map. This one is floating on this building. So follow this path to go up. Pull back to the statue. Head northeast up right on the map. to solve a puzzle here. There's a locked dual pillar. Look up in the north direction, upward on the map, there's a torch. Near the pillar, there's a second torch. Then in the east direction, right side on the map, there's the third one. Turn around in the west direction, left side on the map. Behind this pillar, there's the fourth. Then activate this dual pillar. The water level will go down. Nearby, there's a Sealy in the east direction, right side on the map. Let's follow it. Before we jump down, let's first head north, upward on the map. Climb up on this pillar. There's one floating in the air. Then jump down here in the west direction, left side on the map. There's the first Sealy. Then keep heading west, left side on the map. Complete this challenge. Inside there's a Sealy, so let's follow it. Exit the room here and climb up. Enter the second floor through this window. Then for the last Sealy, let's head east, right side on the map. It's in this corner. After gathering these three Sealy's, this barrier will disappear. Come to the middle here and open the chest. This wind current will appear. Then glide west, left side on the map.
climb up here. The next one is inside this tower in the north direction, upward on the map. Then let's teleport to this waypoint. Head west, left side on the map, towards this building. Climb up here. And is floating near the tree. Next, head north upward on the map. Land on this rock and in the northwest direction, up left on the map. It's floating here. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head south downward on the map. It's floating in front of this waterfall. Teleport back, head southwest down left on the map, it's on this rock. Teleport back and head northwest up left on the map. Jump down here, it's inside this cave. Teleport back. Jump down here in the northeast direction, up right on the map. It's on this pavilion. Teleport back. Glide east, right side on the map. It's floating in the air. Then keep heading east, right side on the map. Jump down here. It's floating near this fallen tree. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head southeast, down right on the map. Jump down here. This one is underneath this bridge. Then keep heading southeast, down right on the map. 
This one is inside this cave. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head north upward on the map. Jump down here. And look down, this one is between the mountains. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head south downward on the map. This one is on this house. Then teleport back. Head west left side on the map. Cross this bridge. Climb up on this lamp. And jump onto this pavilion. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head northeast upright on the map. This one is floating in the air, and we're going to need a geo construct. Teleport back. Head northwest up left on the map. Climb up here. Then head west left side on the map. We're going to climb up on this mountain. Then keep gliding northeast upright on the map. Towards this mountain. Go around the mountain here. And climb up on this building. In the north direction, upward on the map. This one is floating in front of the building. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head southeast down right on the map. This one is floating on the house.
then head west, left side on the map. Go around the rock and head southwest, down left on the map. There's an entrance here. Enter it, and to the right, there's one. Then exit here. Exit here, and climb up in the south direction, downward on the map. Then head northeast up right on the map. This one is floating up here, so we are going to need a geo construct. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Glide around the mountain in the west direction, left side on the map. Jump down here, there's a cave. Don't jump all the way down here. Descend slowly. This one is floating in the air. Then teleport back. Glide around the mountain here and head north upward on the map. Come to the edge and look down, there's one. Teleport back again, and this time we're going to need an animal character. This one is in the air. Activate the pinwheel and ride the wind current up to collect it. Then glide northeast up right on the map. Look down, there's one floating in the air. Teleport back again. Glide southwest down left on the map towards this rock. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head northwest up left on the map. Jump down here, there's one floating in the air. Then land on this platform, 
there's one in the west direction, left side on the map. Let's climb up a bit higher and glide towards it. Next, teleport to this waypoint. Head south downward on the map. This one is on the tree. Then glide southeast down right on the map. It's floating here. Teleport back. Head northeast up right on the map. This one is floating in the air. Then head southeast down right on the map. Climb up here. To your left, near the edge, there's a pinwheel. Use an animal skill to activate it and these rings will appear. Follow the rings to collect the next one. Then head south downward on the map. This one is floating in the air, so we're going to need a geo construct. Then teleport to this waypoint. Head west left side on the map. Climb up here. Then climb up on the tree. This one is on this tree. Teleport back. Head east, right side on the map and follow this path. Next, teleport to this waypoint. Head northwest up left on the map.
climb up here. We're going to climb up on this mountain. south downward on the map. Jump down here. There's one near the edge. Then head west left side on the map and follow this path. Here, take a right turn. There's one inside this cave. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Turn around and climb up here. Interact with this statue. We're going to solve a puzzle. First, head south downward on the map. On this rock, there's a device. We're going to rotate it twice, so that it points towards the statue. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Head north upward on the map. On this rock, there's another device. Here we are going to rotate it once, so that it also points towards the statue. And finally, let's teleport to this waypoint. Climb up here in the north direction, upward on the map. There's a third device. And we're going to rotate it three times. After that, let's teleport back to this waypoint. Go back to the statue and activate it. A wind current will appear. Ride the wind current up and in the east direction, right side on the map, these platforms will appear. Follow this path. Come up here on this rock, and there's one. Next, if you have unlocked this domain, you can teleport there directly. If not, teleport to this waypoint and I'll show you how to unlock it. And for those who have unlocked this domain already, you can skip ahead in the video. So first, head north upward on the map.
defeat the enemies here. Then climb up to activate this device. Jump down here in the west direction, left side on the map, to break this rock. You will then get this crystal. Turn around near the water, there's the second rock. Break it as well, and we will get a second crystal. Then come to the middle here, and place them into these two lamps. Finally in the south direction, downward on the map, there's another rock. Get the crystal and place it in the last lamp. The device in the middle will be unlocked. Activate it and the water level will go down. And this domain can be unlocked. Then head northwest up left on the map. There's one floating here. And that should be all 130 Jokali. Now you can offer them to the statue of the seven and get it to level 10. If you are missing one, there's one extra that you can obtain. Or if you are complete, feel free to skip the last one. For the last one, let's teleport to this waypoint. We are going to do a world quest. Jump down here in the southwest direction, down left on the map, and interact with this NPC. Then head northwest, up left on the map. Defeat the enemy and interact with this device. Then head northwest, up left on the map. Climb up here. Near the tree, there's a device that we're going to start. Then head east, right side on the map. There's a second device near the tree. Then head southwest, down left on the map. There's the last device near the tree. There's the last device. Then this chest will appear. Open it and we will get a fragment. Next, let's teleport to this waypoint. Climb up here in the south direction, downward on the map. There's another device, so interact with it. Here facing towards north, upward on the map, there are five devices. First, we are going to activate the third one, so the middle one. Then the far right one, so the fifth one.
then the second one, then the fourth one, and finally the first one, so the far left one. So let me demonstrate. Then this chest will appear. Open it, there's a second fragment. After that, let's teleport to this domain. Head west, left side on the map and climb up here. We are going to climb up on this mountain and it's going to be a long climb, so take your time. Climb all the way up here, and in the west direction, left side on the map. There's the third writing, so interact with it. First, we are going to activate this device in the north direction, upward on the map. Then come back here. Turn east, right side on the map. We are going to activate this device. Then turn west, left side on the map. We are going to activate this device. And finally turn southeast, down right on the map. We are going to activate this device and this chest will appear. Open it, there's the last fragment. After that, let's teleport to this waypoint. Head north upward on the map. Follow this path and enter the cave here. We can use these three fragments to open the gate. Enter here and activate this device. Complete the challenge. Then head northeast up right on the map and follow this path. There's one floating in the air and we're going to need a geo construct. And there's our last geoculus. If you have followed this video this far, then you should have gathered all 131 Geocali with one extra in your inventory.
remember to subscribe and leave a like and I'll see you in the next one.